Welcome to uh, Morning Moments message. Today, I'd like to speak a message for just a few minutes on, uh, on the title of that message is shaken and stirred. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I've enjoyed the James Bond series. And uh, hi, I'm Bond, James Bond. And uh, there's been so many movies that uh, that has been out from that that whole series. Uh, it's, it's a lot of adventure, a lot of excitement, and and James Bond has this saying that he has. Now everybody has their own favorite James Bond. I know that, and uh, I may have my favorite too. You know, but. But the saying that he said in many of those movies is uh, he had his, he loved his martini shaken, not stirred. So today I'd like to share with you shaken and stirred. Now, let me share with you where I'm going with this. The text I'm using today, the main text is in in uh, Luke, it is the uh, sixth chapter and the 38th verse. Now I'm going to share the 38th verse, but I'm going to back up and, and, and read a little bit before, before I get to that. I'm going to start in the, the 35th verse. It says, love your, love your enemies, do good to them, and lend to them ex ex expecting nothing in return. Then your reward will be great, and you will be the sons of the Most High, for he is kind to the ungrateful and the wicked. Be merciful, just as your Father is merciful. And then it goes into judging others. In the context of judging others, this is where what is the next verse. The 37th verse says, do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemned and you will not be condemned forgive and you will be forgiven and then it says the famous scripture that everybody quotes give it give and it will be given to you good measure pressed down shaken together and running over will be poured into your lap for will for with the measure you use it will be measured back to you. Now, that scripture through the years have been misquoted in context of financial giving. It doesn't mean that when you don't give your tithe and give your financial giving, that God doesn't press down, shaking together, running over in that as well. But in the context that scripture is written, it's in the, it's in the context of judging others and what we do for others. Oh, everybody wants to be shaken and stirred. They want those blessings. Oh, stirred. And they want that revival. There's big revival thoughts today, and I'm excited about that. But this, but the, the scriptures here, when it says given, it should be given, talks about judging others and our relationship with others. Oh, I'm so, my heart is broken and hurts so bad. When I see so many people, even on the internet and through social media, bringing, trying to bring down other ministries and other people and judging them. There's a lot of that going on. And, and some of them probably mean well. They mean like, well, I want to show you what God's told me about these people. And they mention ministries' names, they mention people's names, and folks that are trying to do what God's called them to do, and there's an attack from them because they feel they're self-appointed to, to bring everybody down. The scripture says if you want to be shaken down, running over, if you want blessings upon you, it's, it, it talks about judging. And look it up. See if I'm see if I'm right in the content of that scripture. Judge and judge not unless you be judged. 
So, so there's a shaking that's going on. Uh, there's people having messages and revivals and ministries that may be different than yours. There may be some theology that's different than yours. Well, back off, brother, sister. Stop judging them and start doing something for the Lord in a positive way. Speak the goodness of God. We don't need so many people putting others down. We need to tell others about that Jesus is a, a Savior, loves you, and cares for you. So, so be careful of the judgers. And don't be one of them. Because what I want in my life, I want it pressed out, shaken together, and running over. I want to be blessed by God in a way that I can't even contain it. That scripture for years, I read it, breast, breast down, shaken together, and running over. I think, oh, God, I want to be blessed that much. But, that, but are, are we doing what we should. Now, I hope that that message about judging has stirred you. And just like bond, but just a different terminology. I want you to be shaken and stirred. <laughs> Thank you for joining me for morning moment message. Keep coming back spread the message and send this message to others. And may God richly bless you.